What do you have to share with me, Mistios? Magistrate Exanthi, I have black news for you. Your older son is lost. Dead? In the face of danger, Theoros abandoned his shield and fled his duty. This is hard news, a blow upon my heart. I do not thank you for your words, but they needed to be heard. Makarios has started his training at the Agogi, and who knows? Maybe one day, Theoros... I have but one son now, Mistios. To other matters. There are several in the region who could benefit from your presence, Eagle Bearer. Help them. Inspire them, and I'll reward you. Give me their names. The farm owner, Laniki, as well as several of the town's important women, Zita, Zamia, and Zefxo. Who is this farm owner? Laniki runs the farm for her family. Recently, it has been underperforming. She blames the gods and believes the land is cursed. But I wonder if she's too quick to punish her Ilotes. What does Zita need? Her daughter, Zotheras, is as wild and headstrong as an untamed filly. Zita constantly prays for guidance, but I suspect Zotheras needs a more grounded hand to direct her. What should I know about Damia? She has two precocious children who rule the roost in the Agora. They reduce their tutors to tears and stir up the other age mates. She is hoping you can instill some respect in them. What can you tell me about Zevskso? Her husband is off training for war, and she specifically requested an audience with you for help with something quite personal. I'll find them and see what they want of me. May the Dioscuri watch over your path.
يلا اه ايش خروط You wouldn't happen to be the eagle bearer, would you? Me? Yes, I am. Where do you know justice? Your hair must have been woven by Athena. Your body is like a sculpture made by the masters. And your arms look so strong. Strong enough to... Strong enough to... Strong enough to carry this basket to my husband, Kalibos. Oh, right. The magistrate mentioned you. It'll be easy to carry. Thank you so much. Let me know if you need anything. Where might I find Kalibos? He's an important general. His unit is stationed in the northeast near the fort of Presai. Down by the beach. I'll help with your delivery. <laughs> this is heavy. What's in here? Bricks? Amistios? Well met. What brings you to our camp? You are Kalibos. Your wife sent me to deliver this package. I think it might be some kind of offering. Zefxo is a good woman. She's gifted me with a basket fit for Dionysos. Earthly pleasures? She made it sound like it was a case of life and death. A deathly hangover, maybe. Boys, we're having a good night. Care to join us, friend? I never say no to good wine and good company. I expected no less from you.
could someone pass the water skin? Oh, could someone pass my head? I think I left it farther down the beach. Surely this is the after effects of the mushrooms. I remember the chicken coop. I remember the farmer's field. I do not remember building a Trojan horse. Uh, it was just here when I woke up. We offer it to the gods for safe passage across the seas. Boys, let's move this down to the beach. <sighs> boasted to a friend that I was a better tactician than Odysseus himself. Today I was proven wrong. You live to fight another day. Learn from this. Please, thank my wife for her festive gift. I don't know if I should thank her or curse her. Mater told me to meet her at the statue of Artemis in the cedar.
There. Will be good to see Mata and Brasidas again. Who are you? Me? I'm no one. But you? You're even godlier than Brasidas said you'd be. It should be your statue between these trees. Brasidas? What does he have to do with this? Warrior, he said. Look for the mighty warrior with the broken spear. I added the godly bit. Brasidas knows a warrior when he sees one. Word of my deeds will outlive any statue. Of course! Your story should be sung from the mountaintops. In Arcadia, you are already a legend. Where is Brasidas? I need to speak with him. Of course you do. And the woman, you'd like to speak with her too, yes? Wait. She looks like you. Tell me where they went. I should. It's what Brasidas paid me for, after all. Then why don't you? He didn't pay enough. <laughs> Outlive any statue. Who says that? Tell me where they are, or I'll cut that shit eating grin off your shit eating face. He said you had a nasty temper. He wasn't wrong. Tell me where my mother is, or I'll shove my spear so far down your throat. You'll be shitting iron at the gates of Hades. Please, show mercy. Speak! They're on a hill. A cliff overlooking the gear. Brasidas didn't pay you enough? Who did? Tell me, or I'll wrap your guts around your neck and hang you from that tree. The Archon. He's paying more for your head than Brasidas could afford in two lifetimes. Tell me who the Archon is. I want a name. <laughs> La Rose. His name is La Rose. And he's the most powerful man in Arcadia. He who controls the grain, controls the world. You threaten the wrong people, Malaka. I don't threaten. I promise! Ha! You want to... Somebody get water! No! Come on.
I want the Archon dead. Thank the gods you found us. I got your message. I killed the messenger. He betrayed you, Brasidas. These cultists Marini told me about. They knew you were coming and must have forced La Rose to place the bounty on your heads. Trusting anyone in Arcadia will be difficult now. Which is why I say we put that Archon's head on a pike. Our message to the Puppet King and Sparta will be clear. I'm sure he has soldiers everywhere in Arcadia. We'll just behead them all. And deal with it like you dealt with the manga? Why not hire some musicians to entertain the crowd too? I know you wanted me to kill him in private. But at the time, it was the right choice. Whatever happens, we need Lagos alive. Arcadia is Sparta's breadbasket, and Lagos keeps it full. That man is working for the cult of Cosmos, not Sparta. Then we need to free him from their grasp. What makes you think he wants to leave? Bounties and threats aren't Lagos' style. He's a farmer, not a killer. What do you have in mind, Brasidas? Unlike your mother, I think we can handle this quietly. I'm going to begin by investigating a safe house he keeps. There might be some evidence there. What do you think we should do? I still say we send the Archon to Hades. Upsetting Sparta's breadbasket will send the false king searching for crumbs. The Archon is no longer the man you knew. The cult has him now. Looks like I came just in time. You certainly did. But it's time to make a decision. My mother's plan is best. Ah, oh, my lamb. United in blood and purpose. You're letting your impulses overcome your reason. Thousands of Spartans depend on Lagos for food and protection. His death would bring chaos. There's a farmhouse northeast of Tegea where he has a safe house. Meet me there before you do anything you'll regret. And what if Brasidas' plan doesn't work? The Archon hides like a coward in Fort Samikon. You can't miss that monstrosity. You could go after him now, but be careful. He's well defended. Then we must weaken his defenses. He's got barracks full of guards and silos full of grain. It would be a shame if any came to harm. Where exactly are Logosis' guards stationed? Some rest their heads at the barracks in Tegea. There's also a camp and a fort in Smuggler's Forest. Destroy his guards there, and his defenses will be weakened. Tell me where to find the silos. The Archon stores his wheat in Pan's cradle. Set the silos alight, and his livelihood will go up in smoke. I'll go see what Lagos is up to. Good luck, my lamb. You don't understand. This isn't just about fire and wheat. This is personal.